Okay, will you please solve the trucker crisis for us? <laughs> I'll snap my fingers and hopefully we can solve it, but it really uh, requires the entire industry because we are facing just unprecedented times. We're literally living in a shipping Armageddon. But is it not true that if you pay people enough, they will take these jobs, they'll work for Uber, get connected with some big companies, and we can at least make a dent at this problem of not having enough truckers. We can make a dent. If you just zoom out and see what's happening around us, we're just ordering more and more and more packages that we love to consume to our doorstep. But uh, the supply chain is completely imbalanced. You saw that in ports, same with trucks. The entire network is different. And if you think about truck drivers that in the end of the day, need to move those goods, it's harder for them to be on the road. There's better alternative in driving closer to home and maybe doing last mile delivery. Um, and we're asking them to do more and more and more, and maybe they don't want to have in, even go on the road because they have to be stuck in facilities or they have to take on health concerns. So it requires all of us. And yes, I think we could make a difference with technology. This is what we have been doing for the past couple of years. We now have over 1 million truck drivers on the network with the Uber Freight app. So we can find them opportunities with those big companies faster. We can find them and utilize their trucks and fill their empty miles faster. We can provide them more opportunity to structure the week and month faster. We can pay them faster. So we can definitely make a dent with technology, and we are, but it requires more, to your point. Some of it is also about wages. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.